today I'm going to make cola marinated pork ribs. I'm going to season them with three teaspoons of garlic. I don't use salt when I cook, especially on pork, because salt pork is salty already. And three teaspoons of fresh black cracked pepper. Add about a tablespoon of this onion soup mix. The first thing I'm going to do is add in my pork ribs. Just dump them on in. And I have my crock pot set to high. I'm going to dump in. one pound of the crushed tomatoes. I'm going to do a semi-homemade barbecue sauce made with Coca-Cola. Just go ahead and open your can and dump it on in. You're going to take any brand of your barbecue sauce. I have a Kraft original. Put in as much as you can. Get about a half a bottle. And I have my Coca Cola. I put in a half a can. More teaspoons of garlic, a couple more teaspoons of fresh black cracked pepper, grabbing my wooden spoon, I'm just going to mix all the ingredients together. And they're going to sit on high for a couple hours because it's pork. And everything will cook in a crock pot, even slightly frozen. But because it is slightly frozen, I'm going to have it on high for a couple hours. Then turn it to low until dinner. And this meat's going to be delicious, taste like candy, and fall off the bone. Make sure you cover your lid. Make sure it's on high. Just keep warm as my last book dial here, then low, then off. Reverse my old crock pot. I also wanted to add in some ketchup. The ketchup gives it that extra tang. Here are my pork ribs, and they smell absolutely incredible. And I'll be taking them out of the crock pot a little bit. It's got a cool way down. It is very hot. I'm going to take the ribs out of the crock pot so you can see what they look like on my platter. And here they come. That semi homemade barbecue sauce. Falls right off the bone, made with a Coca Cola marinade. I poured right on into the crock pot here to make sure all the meat is out. And my husband will take out some of the au jus, put into the Phoebe mug, and I'm going to throw the corn in the microwave. Here are what my cola ribs look like and they look and smell amazing. Here's what my cola marinade ribs look like on the plate with the potatoes and corn and I cannot wait to dive in. It has become a family favorite within my household.